hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm explaining about the statistics in zoom application so as you know we have completed general video audio share screen chat background and filters recording so far i just skipped the profile section because it's completely uh, on the web based browser based you need to log into the um, zoom account using a browser and you need to change from there so i will uh, i'll be discussing this video about this one in the last video of this tutorial series now we will be discussing the statistics parts so what is basically statistics you can see here once you click here uh, it will show overall performance like how much cpu is being used uh, for zoom zero percentage overall 40 percentage of cpu is being used it will be keep on changing like 42 to 44 if there is a high memory or oh sorry high processor requirement it will be increasing fine and you can see the memory consumption as well 88 MB is being used right now overall 3.29 GB is being used out of 7.84 GB and you can see here bad one network type proxy you can see none of them are shown here because we didn't have any meeting started so that's why it's not showing anything audio video and screen sharing it's normally uh, does not show even if we started the meeting uh, let's see how it is changing here so once i click on the uh, new meeting and once i click on join with computer audio you can see completely everything is being changed for example uh, the zoom um, uh, zoom space uh, zoom cpu usage beam become two percentage to one percentage and uh, memory usage is changed already 115 mb and you can also see here bandwidth how much is the bandwidth actually there is no participants that's why it's not sending and receiving any uh, data and also you can see the type of connection i'm using a wi-fi connection it will show here if it's an ethernet connection also it will show here proxy i don't use any proxy that's why it's not showing connection type cloud uh, data center you are connected to zoom global network where data centers in the united states it's also showing through which data center i am connecting to the uh, zoom cloud and also encryption of the uh, algorithm and encryption algorithm is a is 256 and version is also being displayed here version of the uh, zoom software that i'm using and audio video and screen sharing it does not show anything even if i uh, go to the meeting and sharing the screen it's not going to show anything because there is something wrong with the permission that is received by firewall because i already enabled the firewall i believe that was the problem so anyway but you can see the overall performance over here and you can just troubleshoot if it's using uh, a lot of cpu or uh, memory you can just troubleshoot the problems so this will show the statistics and in the next video we'll be discussing about the keyboard shortcuts accessibility and the last video it will be about profile section thank you for watching guys subscribe the channel click the bell icon for notification take care goodbye